Hey, what's going on guys? It's Pat and you know what guys? I think we may actually have a chance to do Alteric Valley. I've been wanting to do it. And it is the call to arms. Hopefully that means that people our level will be queuing for it. And the queue is only 14 minutes. That's not that bad. That's not that bad. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go look for this damn pet. I'm gonna find it, guys. I promise you that. While we're in queue. I swear I'm gonna get the pet and I'm gonna do Alteric Valley. Both things I've been trying to do for way too long. It's really sad. Anyways, guys, I hope so. We'll see you in a couple minutes. To be perfectly honest with you guys, I want to get the hell out of this zone. I just want to find this pet before I go. The plan really is, um, if this goes well, this probably won't go well at all. I want to do the, the battleground and get the pet, and then I'm leaving this zone for a new zone. Because it's 50 to 55, I'm not spending the whole time here. I kind of did the quest that I went here for, so I just want to get my stuff and get the hell out of this place. And get you a new zone. Not sure which zone, but I'll find one. It's almost time for Burning Crusade anyway. Sort of, sort of getting there. And yeah, I'm still in queue. It's been five and a half minutes. We are halfway almost through the queue. I'm really praying on it. If As long as one of the things gets done, I'm going to be pretty happy about it at least. Where the hell is this damn thing? Oh my god, a green power crystal. Oh god, I have aggro on something. Do I? Oh god, here comes a giant beast. But yeah, I'm still working on this quest, guys. Um, I figured I might as well get it done. The green power crystals are clearly around here somewhere since I see them. Figured, why not? Why not work on it? I've got to come across that thing sometime in my life. Feels like it's been my whole damn life searching for it. I'm probably going to get killed by the hunter over here with my luck. Why is this move not working? I do not have a... I thought I just summoned him. Is he dead? Oh, he's dead. All right, that makes sense. All right, need to resurrect him. He must have died in that epic quest where I was fighting that giant beast that didn't go so well, if you guys remember. All right, there we go. All right, give me some of these damn green crystals. I want to finish this one. Only one. That's a, that's a rip off, is what it is. I'm gonna kill this person. I am pissed. All right, they're 59. I'm just gonna leave. Never mind. I was kidding. I'm, I like them. All right, let's go. All right, there's gotta be somewhere. Somewhere that's gotta be, guys. I. Oh my God, there it is. No, is that's not it. Is that it? No, it's not. Is it? No, it's not. <laughs> it's like pinkish, isn't it? The one that I'm looking for. I don't think I've seen this one though. Looks kind of cool. Jen, that's not it, right? But that's not it, right? No. Alright, I'm making sure. Just making sure. Alright, this is the first devil sword I saw running around. It made me a little nervous. Alright, I'm looking for one that has a cooler color to it. That one just looks like kind of plain, probably. But it's small. It doesn't look as cool as it does in gi giant mode. Yes. Alright. Um, one more crystal would be awesome if I could find one. It's like a Bad. Maybe that's a good sign, actually, that I saw that one. Maybe I'll see a, another one. <laughs> I don't even know what I'm looking for. I've been spending so much time looking for it. I don't even know what the hell I'm looking for. I kind of do. I know it's a different color than that. Last green crystal. Uh, there we go. Right in the bones of this thing. And there's a quest over here. Why not Why not just pick it up, you know? It's probably like, bring this crate to Spriggle or something. Return this to Wildeden. Close enough. Sprinkle, Wilded Den, same thing. Okay, now we have two quests standing, guys. Nice. Alright, guys, while we wait, we might as well hand in these quests. I don't see why not. It won't hurt. Alright, I've got all your crystals. And... Okay, you don't want to give me another quest, I see. Alright, what about the other one? I found this. This one definitely will continue to something. What have you got there? Oh, wow. It's some really old food. That's exactly what I wanted to bring. Hey. Holy and I, take a look at this. This human brought us old rations that we abandoned. No, not from Marshall's refuge, from the old base camp. Turns his back towards you. Okay, let's just. Okay, can't turn. Okay, never mind. I can't make him turn away from me. I'm not sure I want to peek inside. I'll just give it to Nolan, I guess. He'll know what to do with it. See you around. Where's Nolan? Who's Nolan? Where the hell is he? Nurgle? No, that's not Nurgle. It's Nolan. I see. Oh God, I'm on fire. Okay, no new quest. He'll just, he'll just, you know, he's a little lazy. He's taking his time. Hey Alright, whatever. I do have a quest hand in here. But, um... Where's this beast? I'm still looking for it, guys. How long into the queue? We're ten minutes in. It should go any minute, I promise you. Good news, guys. Alteric Valley has finally went. I thought that we'd never get into it, honestly. I really like this one. It's really hard to get into unless you're level cap, but luckily, that is the... One of the week this time or day or whatever it is, doesn't matter to me. Alright, we've discovered Alterac Valley. 
Walter Egg Valley is really cool um, battleground. A lot of people um, don't like it. At least people that I've talked to hate it a lot. I kind of really like it. I don't know why. It was one of my first ones. I think that's it. Usually when it's your first one, you really really feel something for it like you know how people really enjoy they're like oh i miss world of warcraft when it first came out vanilla wow um you know because you know it's like the memory really in my opinion i think that makes people like things the most um and for me memory of alteric valley i like alteric valley it's with that with a lot of games like you know i don't know i didn't start playing wow when it first came out so i'm cool with it i love the expansions i love the new content but people who played right at the beginning you know it's like the memory of it Makes it seem even better than it really was. That's just my opinion, but of course, I'm always right. Or wrong. One of the two. I'm one of the two. Anyways, I might as well explain this before the 53 seconds are up. This is probably the most complicated battleground that there is. Alright. You can see right here um, the lion symbol and the horde symbol. Because we start up here and they start down here. And these little hut looking things... That is where the boss is, and the object of this map is to get there and to kill the other boss. We have to kill their boss, and it will be protected by five other bosses or four other bosses. These people are yelling like crazy, making it hard for me to concentrate. Guys, calm down. And um, you have to get rid of some of those if you want to be able to fight the boss, or it's just horribly hard. Too hard. And to do that, you have to capture these towers, and they have to capture our towers. What you do there is you go there and you capture the banner... And after you hold it, oh my god, you guys shut the hell up. This is ridiculous. I hate, I can't stand when people are all yelling and shit while I'm, get, concentrate. It's just not nice. Alright, okay, but basically we need to capture those. And if you hold them for long enough, then you will capture them and then, um, you'll own, uh, the, the boss will disappear at the end. So you need to do that to a bunch of places, but if they have come to your place and gotten your banner, you can go back there and recapture it for yourself so you don't lose the boss. And that, if this game's really about recapturing um, these over and over again. There's also mini bosses in the middle that will take away um, one of them as well. But um, the real key to victory is is to make sure that you keep yours alive in general. It also lengthens the game significantly if too many people are doing that, though. Most people just run to the end, but um, a, a small team of, like, you know, five, six players can really, um, usually is what wins the game. You know, if they're recapturing the ones that were tried to be captured by, you know, the other team. It's, it's kind of hard to, 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 you know, actually say out loud. But once you play it a few times, you really understand it. It is kind of hard to explain. It's the hardest one to explain by far. Um, the first boss is right in here. And this will get rid of one of the bosses at the end as well. This one's pretty easy. These are always, these are always easy. And another, actually, that's their, see, this is theirs. I'm getting the sides confused again. We could go in there and defend that, and some people do do that. Um, it's not as common. Well, some people do it. But yeah, the, soon the Horde are going to be rushing there, but we are rushing theirs, which is right there. So they are right there, as you can see. We're all basically doing the same thing. This is a, really a race. Um, if you don't kill the boss at the end, this will actually, it can still end. Reinforcements, if you kill 500 people then and get it down to zero, you'd win. But you actually get like, it's like 80 or, I think it's 100 for um, each boss um, or capture you. Each damn tower you capture will go down 100, so you can't end it through kills, which happens rarely and is extremely long when that happens. There's also graveyards and shit to capture as well, which um, will make you respawn farther down this way. I know it sounds really complicated when I say it, but it's really not that bad. There is a lot of PvP involved, but less so than some of the other um, PvP maps. As you can see, this is easy. Everyone just, you know... But you can't do this. The last boss will just, it's just, he's just the monster, especially with um, the other guys protecting. Gotta take off Growl. Poor Dave almost got killed. And we got some experience as well. And as you can see, this went down to 399. So it took away 100. So if we kill 400 more of them, then we'll be back there. Another explanation, guys. There's one more important thing to say. There are mines at the side. A mine there and a mine there. And if you capture those, your reinforcements will actually start going back up. So if you're in one of those really close matches, then um, it is worth capturing those. I probably should have gone in here to help. I need. It's it's important to capture these guys. And um, there's actually a lot of people in there. I'm going to go to the next tower. Oh, God, a person. I love to kill people. But the thing is, um, when you capture them, you have to stay there and wait. You have to stay there and wait. All right, have 25,000 honorable kills. Nice that they've added everything together for me. It makes me look like a beast. Thank you for sharing that quest with me. 25,000? Jesus, I've done some PvP in my day, haven't I? I had no idea I'd killed that many people. All right, I'll just accept these. Most of these most people don't do. I can't even mount. Can't mount. 
I'm in combat still. I hate when that happens when you're not really like in. Maybe I am or stayed. Never mind, I'm not. This is one we need to capture as well. How many people are in it is the question. It looks like a lot, but the problem is a lot of people leave it. I'm actually gonna head north. I'm just gonna do what everyone else does. And which will probably lead to the most PvP though, just so you know. Hopefully. Usually there's a chunk of people back at the beginning. Something like that. And there's the mine. I could capture this, but there's no point really. Unless, um, if we were in a big battle where we weren't letting each other capture anything, you'd want the mines. Um, when my girlfriend had a really bad computer, we'd just go capture the mine. Because we'd have to do something and we wanted to play together. And that's where it wouldn't lag. <laughs> Isn't the mine? Because this place can really lag if you have a bad computer. It really would. We could capture this one here and we're gonna. You know, I'm, I want to be the one to do it. Give me the... Give me the satisfaction. Oh, God, I'm nervous. Don't hit me. I'll be honest, though. Let me just see if I got this. I don't know. I probably got it. No, I didn't. <laughs> and, um, of course, they could easily capture that back. Um, I should stand there, probably, but I'm not going to. Because I need to get into the action, guys. I can't just I can't just sit here. I mean, walk around. I can't just sit there, you know? I just can't do it. There's two more to capture this way, and this is their, these are the hardest ones to capture. And usually this is where the most PvP is going to be in the map. Now I'm trying to show you guys. I'm trying to explain it to you guys who haven't done it, and, um, you know, guys who are newer to the game. I feel like that would help. Yeah. All right, down here is one of the final graveyards. And we already have it, but I probably... This one's really important to protect. You want to make sure we all respawn here because the boss is right in there. I don't know what the hell some people are doing. or like walking in there already. It's a tad early. Just be careful. But yeah, it's really important to guard things. This takes like a minute or two to guard, but um, if they were to get it back, it'd be a big problem. They could really come from... There really isn't that many spots they could come from, I guess. Oh, I was going to say, I'll be honest. Back in the day, back in the day, I would AFK this shit. And get my points. I don't know what was wrong with me. That's a not. That's not a good thing to do. I'd sit. I'd be on horde. I'd sit like right on the side of the gate. Back then, no one reported you. I was looking burning crusade. All right. So I'm just standing here, guys. But you know what? This is important duty. Someone's got to do it. So I'll do it. I'm really hoping we gain from this. That'd be awesome. Because it is. Think. Think about it, guys. This is the call to arms. I'm gonna get bonus experience up the ass from this. All right. That's right. Okay, I don't know what the hell I'm doing. This is kind of boring, but... All right. I actually see some PvP going on over here, but I really don't want to leave it, but I... The call for battle is, is part of my heart. I can't... can't stop it. Just being honest. My throat actually kind of hurts, but not a good thing. I'll kill this Snape. He spelled Snake wrong. It's Snape. All right, he yelled. That means that someone aggroed him, usually. I think so, at least. All right, back to defending. I know, a rogue could just sneak in, though. That would be a problem. Once we own this, though, it's defended, and we could easily get it back. How much experience did I get? The experience went over here. All right, we're going to gain from this, because I can promise you that. We are, um... We're lying, so we're winning. We're up 374 to 304, and... Now we're... We're... We're losing. Okay. <laughs> it's basically even, though. It doesn't really matter. How are we doing? Checking the map... Um, this one has been destroyed. We are protecting this, as you can see. No, this, these are the ones we need. No! We're protecting it. Okay, we lost it. Did we? I can't see. There's too many people standing on it. So, yeah, we've lost those. If they're in conflict, like that, you can tell. Um, and those ones can be recaptured by them. I mean, we see, we have no one defending this one, which is a problem, and they can recapture it. I mean, we can recapture it. Shit, I do not know what side I'm on at all. It's ridiculous. Like, we, we just recaptured this one, and we might, re and we could recapture this one, but um, clearly someone's there, as I saw, like, three dots disappear. But it is good that we own that. And I'm not doing much, but I'm explaining my best. And the, the battle is 222 to 218. I know this, it does seem like it could be boring, but this can be very exciting as well. And it's more, like, intricate, you know what I mean? It's not just kill people, there's, like, some thought process involved, and teamwork. This works the best, though, if you have, like, a group of, like, five friends or something. All right, we own it. I'm good to go. So now I can leave that alone because um, even if they capture it, then I, we could just take it back. I don't want to have to wait a few minutes. And we're all going to respawn there now. All right, let's just check these towers. And we need to own these, so I'm going to go up here and help. I'm actually getting a decent amount of experience, I have to say. Can't complain about that. And I'm unrested until the next level, which is always nice. I love Alterac Valley. Don't hate on it. It's awesome. 
It's a cool place, I mean, um... Where, okay, no one's here but me. What was that buff? It was like a giant bell. That's what I saw. Alright, I think that, um... We're gonna own this soon. Alright, we own it. Time to jump. Oh, God. Alright, nice jump by me. Epic jump. And it is time to fight the boss, guys. 65, that means we better get there before they kill ours, basically. Because they're down to 200, they can fight it right now, too. And we're already fighting it. It is not Draken. That is one of the little dudes. And right here, we gotta be the first to kill it. If they kill it first, they win, so this is really important. And you gotta really pull out all your stops with your DPS. Every move, I'm hitting all kinds of shit. I don't even know what I'm doing, guys. I'll do it for the win. That's what I'll do. The more people in here, the better. Um, a lot of people rush this, but um, we actually played this really well, I think, to be honest. You'll actually know when the other team starts because the boss yells. I didn't, wasn't really paying attention to it. But um, I believe that they're fighting ours as well because I see the yell right there from Bandar. So we need to finish it first. Finish it. Sometimes you'll lose like the last second. It's awful. Oh, and we have won, and I've gotten a victory. And I've... Oh my god, that's a lot of experience. That fucking... It's awesome. <laughs> right? That's awesome. That was awesome amount of experience. I love Alterac Valley. I love you, Alterac. All right. Did I do anything worthwhile at all? That's what I'm going to see. I did get a killing blow. That's nice. And some damage. And I did assault the graveyard. That's not too bad. And plus I helped defend, which is always a nice thing to do, guys. People, A lot of people won't do it, but you really should. It really helps. Not that anyone went after it or anything like that, but I I did it anyway. And now they have um, these buffs. What's this bell, anyway? Strength, agility, and intellect increased by 5% for an hour. That's nice. Um, another thing that they added, um, I don't know when they added I think Cataclysm is Honorable Defender. So if you're defending, you get like bonus honor points, which honor points are to buy your gear, so it's awesome. That's right. Anyways, guys, hope you enjoyed today. I am I am stoked. I got a lot of experience, and I really, uh, you know, I, I got to do Alter Valley, so I'm happy about that. Anyways, guys, um, hope you enjoyed it, and I'll see you guys later.